Today I'm going to show you how to connect the IG2000 CBM indicator to the line isolation monitor IG6 connector plate. We're going to start by using the terminals on the back of the indicator and connecting those A and B terminals to the A and B terminals on the connector plate itself. Once we've made that connection, now we're ready to connect our safe and hazard and our common. Let's start by using the common and wiring that to the common onto the connector plate. That's done by connecting one wire to the common on the back of the IG2000 and connecting to the 12 volt DC common on the connector plate. The next thing we have is our safe button. We're going to go ahead and connect that safe button to the RI1. This is the only connection that will need to be made because the safe and hazard button works together harmoniously within the IG2000 CBM. Thank you.